Wake up, people! This is Ted here with another Word Nerd Wednesday. It's great to see all your smiling faces. You're watching the premier word origins and derivations channel. It isn't words you don't know or haven't used, but it's where does the word come from? And if you like my content, go to my YouTube channel, like and subscribe and ring that bell so you'll be notified every time I upload. Well, this week's word is the word escape. We all know that word. Escape functions both as a noun and a verb, and we tend to use it metaphorically as much as we do literally, as referring to vacations, or as an escape from reality. However, its original definition is much more physical and fun. The word escape is associated with so many stories of heroes and villains avoiding punishment. And so many of my favorite movies have Escape in the title. Escape from New York. Escape from Sobibor. And the greatest of all, The Great Escape. But where does the word come from? Well, it's Latin, and most people know that ex stands for out of, and this word comes from 12th century vulgar Latin, ex capre, which means out of the cape, or leaving someone holding only your cape. Someone who has made an escape, then, is now ex capre. It wasn't until the 14th century that the word became a noun, and not until the 19th century was it used in the metaphorical sense of an escape from mental or emotional distress. Well, there you go, that's the word for this week, and just remember, guys, it's never too late to redo, rebuild, reboot, restart, Kindle rebirth your life, you can always turn it around and go in any direction you like. Let's create a renaissance on Earth. Oh, and one more thing. That's my cape. And you're wearing it all wrong, it's getting dirty. You don't like dirt. <laughs> I Open your mouth, don't bite. <laughs> Whose cape is it? It's, it's my cape. Yes, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <Fast burner. laughs>